Oh, and big, big news, exciting news though for homeowners. Exciting news for, for homeowners. homeowners. Oh yeah, you can kill burglars now. I think that's the gist of it. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's it, I'm not sure. You can put bear traps around your house uh, and you know, yelp in the middle of the night. I think basically a slapstick rule should apply. If it goes... <laughs> you're fine. If you kill the guy, not so much. Yeah. <laughs> if, 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 you're, you're allowed to be proportionate in your violence towards burglars, but not grossly yeah. proportionate. So if what you're doing to the burglar could feature in one of the Saw movies... <laughs> <laughs> Film, yeah, yeah, exactly. Try and you know whack them by turning around with a ladder, <laughs> you know a bucket on their head. Who has received a hero's welcome at the conference? Batman. Yeah. Yes, the bit where Batman came. No, not yeah. Batman. Oh, Boris. <laughs> Boris. 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 Boris said he wanted to be tough on crime, and this was after apparently he's had six bikes nicked. And you're wondering, has he really had six bikes nicked, or six times he just hasn't got a clue where he in fact left? <laughs> What was the hero's welcome? What did they do for him? So they just, they kind of clapped. Uh, <laughs> it wasn't like they, you know, they, they threw rose petals or anything like that. They were just very happy to well, see him. Well, the hero's welcome. You know in Aladdin, when he's on the, on the elephant and it's, hey, clear the way in the old bazaar. Hey, you, let us through. It's a bright new star. Oh, come be the first on the block to meet his eye. You know, you're gonna love this guy. That... <laughs> I, I defer to your definition of a hero as well, about no time to advise <laughs> arriving on, near, or confusingly like an elephant. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they, gave, they also gave him, like they give everyone at the Tory party conference, they gave him a two-minute standing ovation. That's what they give absolutely everyone, whatever they've said. It makes perfect sense. It's 30 seconds of clapping and a minute and a half for most of them to stand up. <laughs> In bracket over there. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> in other news, oh. outside the party oh. conference, what have hospital patients been asked to rate? They have been asked to rate, apparently, exactly how good the A and E departments are. The question is, would you recommend this A and E department okay. to your friends and family? <laughs> well, what are you going to say to them? Oh well, don't worry, you've had an accident. You're going to St Mark's, and that's got a crack in A and E. Change the beginning of okay. Casualty. Well, it was just a man falling off his shed onto his garden rake and then crawling to his laptop to go on TripAdvisor. <laughs> <laughs> or just come home to your partner, square up and go, I'm going to send you someplace nice. <laughs> 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 well, I, I've never heard domestic violence put quite as charmingly as that. <laughs> the, um, yes, I, I, I look like they put don't know in. There's, there's, a, there's an extremely likely, likely, neither likely nor unlikely, yeah. likely, extremely likely, don't know. Don't ask the people with concussion. <laughs> <laughs> How would you rate it? Hmm? Cabbage? Banana? <laughs> Mummy? Cabbage? Mum? <laughs> the people who give the lowest rating are dead. So, yeah. the results are going to be unavoidably skewed. Yeah, yeah. That's going to be a very awkward conversation when they go, I'm sorry, we've lost him. Do you think he was satisfied with the <laughs> 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 